it's a new day today and we're going to review another NFT play to earn game. Hello guys, my name is Katropa aka Big Boss Tita and I review crypto and NFT play to earn games. And if you are just new to my channel, make sure to click that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you would always be updated with the latest happenings in anything crypto and NFT play to earn games. Go ahead and smash that like button as well and don't forget to comment down below because I give away Gcash prizes to lucky commenters. And if you're already subscribed, I guess you're very very lucky because you'll always be updated with the newest in anything crypto and NFT play to earn games which means you will be best positioned to make more earnings all right so today guys we're going to look at nineco so nineco is an nft play to earn game much like a fusion of axie infinity and rpg idol gameplay so basically guys here you can see these cute little cat things are what we can breed and use to fight and if you see here there's a 3v3 um, kind of system as well very much like axie infinity but the difference is it's an idol rpg type gameplay which means you won't really have to do much you know so so i'm not sure if you guys noticed but this kind of gameplay is actually becoming quite a trend nowadays idle gaming especially in play to earn games really is making the round so there's a lot coming out that's uh, similar to this that's because it's easy to understand it's easy to play and also very easy to earn but the difference between Nineco and these other idle gameplay games is Nineco actually has a breeding system. Like I said earlier, it's it's a lot like Axie Infinity. You were seeing cards and all that earlier and actually body parts. So obviously, like I mentioned earlier, it's a play to earn game. And in this game, you can actually summon, breed, and trade Ninecos on the marketplace. That's how you can earn. And then you can also stake NFT Ninecos and the Nino tokens to earn and redeem in-game rewards and you can also trade game items with other players right so those are the ways for you to earn in Nineco and here we can take a look at some of the ninja cats that we can actually get or play with here in Nineco so these cute little things are what we're going to get and play with so there's a lot of them there's a lot of different um, styles there are a lot of different characters a lot of different looks so it's going to be not boring that's for sure now as for the gameplay we already discussed this this is an idle system that means you can gain incremental rewards and automatically train your Nineco over time without grinding so why is this idle system so important like I mentioned earlier because it's easy to play easy to understand and also easy to earn but most of all guys this is a time saver so for those people who do not have the entire day to grind like in Axie Infinity they can just you know do a couple of taps and the ninja cats will do everything for you then you just keep collecting rewards now Neko also has a rich gameplay which means you can progress through the campaign and fight enemies from destroying your village and you can also race to finish in the ninja's tower right so you can also trade like i mentioned earlier you can go to the marketplace and you know do nft flipping you can buy you can sell you can do all that you're free to trade basically outside of the game and like we mentioned earlier what makes Nineco unique from other idol systems is the genetic system which means two Ninecos can be combined to generate new breeds based on their parents genes so when you fuse together two different genes and breed them then you get a different combination and here guys you have to be strategic in assembling your team if you want to win so basically Nyanekos all have different skills and also different play styles so you have to really be strategic in order to win now there are also seasons and events much like in axie infinity so every every three months i think there's an end of a season uh, but apart from that guys there are also events where you can compete with other players to get valuable rewards 
So let's take a look at the roadmap, guys. So basically, guys, back in October 2021, they already began testing the NFT Nekos and the marketplace. And then um, actually, we're already here, January 2022. And it's actually already the official launch of Nineco. So this has been officially launched. Uh, you can already get started with this game. And by April 2022, guys, the Guild War will be done. And May 2022 will be the village building. So these are another layer or a different aspect of a gameplay in Nineco. So you don't just simply, you know, battle it out. There's also other aspects of this game that you can play with. Now, guys, let's take a look at the tokenomics. So their main token, guys, is the Nineco token, which the symbol is Nino, right? So it's going to be under Binance Smart Chain. And there's a total supply of 200 million. So right now... 200 million now let's look at the token distribution guys all right so this is the allocation of funds basically 15 percent goes to the team 10 percent goes to the advisor and strategies 35 percent on private sale 15 percent on ideal sale 5 percent went to liquidity and 20 percent goes to game incentives now this is not the best tokenomic i've seen guys but this is also not the worst so as long as they play their cards right considering this is an idle rpg gameplay plus a breeding game you know uh, there might be a lot of other options to really burn that supply now guys, this is the team of Nineco. So everyone basically is docs. They all have LinkedIn accounts. So you can go to their website, go ahead and check their LinkedIn accounts. Everything is there. And as for their partners, guys, they actually have quite a few partners that actually have a good background. So that's always good to see. And their token is also already audited by very chains. Now guys, let's go ahead and get started and check out this game. This is actually going to be available for download in Windows, also for Mac OS, and it's also going to be available in iOS and Google Play. And for those who do not have any of that, there's also going to be an APK download right there. Okay, so let's just click get started and let's see, let's try this out. So firstly guys, when we try to play, it's going to ask us to register. So what we need to do is to go to market.nineco.com. Much like in Axie Infinity, how we have to go to the marketplace and register and everything. That's how it's also going to work here. Now after we go to the market.nineco.com, we need to also connect our wallet and then click on account and set up our email and password. And then of course we have to confirm our email address. So let's go ahead and do that. Once we're here in the marketplace guys, all we need to do is to connect to MetaMask. And then it's going to ask us to sign a signature. Let's just go ahead and do that. You're not going to see it on my screen because of a my recording mode but basically yeah um after you sign then you would be logged in to the marketplace and this is where you will see your username now guys like in the instructions earlier all we need to do is to click on account and we need to set up our email and password so let's just click on setup and once you have that down just click on update so guys, you're going to get an email confirmation much like this one. So all you need to do is to click verify email now. And then all you need to do is to click confirm email. Then your email will be confirmed. So after that, you can log into the game using PC, Android, or iOS using the email and password that we put in earlier. So here in the marketplace page, you guys, you also have an option to change your account settings. So all you need to do is to click on your username right here and then click on account settings. And this is where you can change your username and your email as well as your password. Now looking at the main interface of the marketplace, we can see that this is really a lot like Axie Infinity. So you can actually filter your search according to the factions of each Nineco and as well as their classes and whether it's an alpha. So alpha generation basically is the equivalent of the origin axes in Axie Infinity. So that means these were the first ever Ninecos to be minted. 
Also, you can filter it by stage, whether it's a newborn or an adult. Also, much like in Axie Infinity, there's a limit to how many times you can breed your Ninekos. So basically, you can also filter your search depending on the breed count of the Nineko. So right now, guys, the cheapest Nineko that we can see in the market is 472.95 USD. So right now, guys, the lowest price we can find for one Nineko is 472.95 USD. So that's approximately 25,000 in pesos. So if you're one of the early people who got to buy an NFT here in Neneko, you guys are incredibly lucky because these things are not cheap. And as the game grows further in popularity, we can expect that the prices of these Ninekos might hike up even further in the future. So once we've registered our account already in the marketplace, guys, we can proceed to download the game. So from the main page, guys, just download, just choose here, whatever platform you're going to be using. So if you're using Mac, just click here. If you're using iOS or Android, you can click here. Or if you just want the APK download, you can just click right there. For now, I am using my laptop. So I'm going to go ahead and download the Windows version right here. So it's going to download download a zip file and you're just gonna wait for that to finish downloading so once we're done downloading the file guys all we need to do is to extract the zip file and then run the Nineko application right here once we've done that it's going to take you to the screen right here all we need to do is to put in the email and password that we used to register earlier in the Nineko marketplace then we can either click login or play now either way it's going to take you to the same screen right here so you can just go ahead and read that up real quick and then x that out and then click on enter so basically guys this is going to be a short tutorial on how to play the Nineko game so let's go ahead and start with the first challenge okay so let's click on adventure guys now guys in the adventure mode as you can see here this is an auto gameplay you don't really have to do anything once you enter adventure mode the opponents are going to spawn automatically at random intervals and your Nineko's are automatically going to fight that and your crew members will automatically fight uh, the current stage and collect resources for you and as the stage goes further you are going to be getting more rewards okay so if you notice guys Every time you defeat an opponent here, there's going to be like green fishes that you get and it's going to go automatically to this chest right here and then later on you can collect the rewards right there. So every 10 hours that reward is going to disappear so you have to collect it before then. Okay, so if we go here and choose battle, we go to the battle mode. So here you can choose the Ninekos that you want to drop in the formation. Basically, you can drop up to six Ninekos here, but since we have three, let's go ahead and just drop all of them in. Alright, then let's go ahead and fight. Now, you can actually increase or decrease the speed of battle right here. Okay, so you can have this fast forwarded, uh, which is going to make it even easier and faster for you to earn. So um, you can you can choose to fast forward the gameplay, but if you want to watch, let's just go with times one. So here we're going to see how they battled out. So basically, it's a three versus three right now. So as you can see, the graphics is awesome. So whenever they do a special move, you're going to see special graphics come up like that one. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm really amazed with the graphics of this. It's very simple yet very effective. Um, it's, it's like a real eye candy for me. Okay, so you can choose to also make the speed faster if you know you don't want to watch but for me i enjoy watching the graphics of how they fight it out um and then once you win there's actually an mvp after every fight and then you get uh rewards 
So every time we complete a quest, we actually also get rewarded. So there's a lot of different quests. Like for example, this one. Once you've passed the stage 1-1 one, one in adventure, we get 1,000 green fish. So let's go ahead and click that and collect that. Now we can also upgrade crew members and arm them. Let's go ahead and check out how to do that. All we need to do is to go to your Ninekos. And then choose or select whichever Nineko you want to upgrade or level up. Now, upgrading this crew member is as simple as clicking this green arrow right here. And what you will be using is your green fishes. Okay, so this is the amount of green fish you need to upgrade your Nineko. So we have 3,130 fish right now so that's a lot we can go ahead and just keep on upgrading this baby right here until we get to our desired um level we can also arm this crew member let's go ahead and do that by clicking on the shuriken now let's choose auto equip if we do that it's automatically going to equip whatever items that you have now you can actually upgrade your Nineko up to level 30. That is the max level that your Nineko can get to. And then remember guys, like I mentioned earlier, every 10 hours, the rewards here in the chest is going to disappear. So remember to collect that through the day, okay? So we can go ahead and collect the AFK rewards are away from keyboard. That means you can just, you know, leave your Ninekos in the adventure mode and it's automatically going to get rewards for you. Okay, so this time I am going to go for times two on the speed. There you go. So as you can see, graphics of this, wow. So there's even like close ups and everything. Like I mentioned, it's kind of like in Tekken. So you see like uh, special graphics whenever there's a, whenever you execute a, like a special move or whenever you kill an opponent. So it's really, really awesome. Really an eye candy. Really fun to play. Now being able to increase the speed of the gameplay is really, really helpful guys. Because as you progress along in the stages, then you get more opponents. And that means that there's going to be a longer game time. So being able to kind of fast forward through the gameplay is really going to save you a lot of time. So once you're able to finish stage 2, 9, the world map is going to be available to you. And that will give you access to the open world wherein other game modes are available and other places will be available for you to explore. So this is where you can also access the arena or the PvP mode and the magic tree. So Nineko also has their social media accounts and they are relatively big communities. So they already have a pretty big Discord community with about 53k members. As for their Telegram group, they already have around 72k members. They also have a Facebook page which has around 60k followers. And also their Twitter has a whopping 104.9k followers as well. They also have a YouTube channel now with about 28.7k subscribers. So looking at everything guys, looking at the big picture, this game is really shaping up to be the next Axie Infinity. It has the elements of Axie Infinity at the same time, it has elements of the new trend of RPG idle gaming style which takes away the difficult elements in Axie Infinity of grinding, having to grind the entire day to be able to get something. So a combination of these two ingredients just might make Nineko the next big thing. But of course guys, there is no NFT game without a downside or a risk. So please make sure to always do your own research first. So they have their socials right here. You can go ahead and check those out. And also their website is nineko.com. They also have a white paper. You can go ahead and scroll through that to read up more and understand how Nineko gameplay works. And basically how everything works in Nineko so that you can make an informed decision before you decide to jump in. 
Well, I hope you enjoyed today's video review, guys. But as always, do your own research, manage your own money, and know the risks before you decide to jump into anything crypto. So that's it for today's video, guys. Please do join my Telegram group. You can find the link down in the description box below so you can be eligible to tons and tons of prizes here in my channel. Again, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below. Go, go, go!